Today, I am deeply honored to be in Kazakhstan capital, Astana, for the fifth organization of the World Nomad Games. This assembly is not only an occasion where traditional sports come together, but also a reunion that shows the world how determined we are to keep our shared cultural heritage alive and hand it to future generations. <laughs> Kazakhstan recently experienced a great flood disaster, but it overcame this calamity and made a great effort to organize traditional games successfully. Astana's dedication to this historical event reflects the strength and resilience of the Kazakh people and their commitment to our traditions. I would like to express my sincere gratitude to the President of Kazakhstan, Mr. Tokayev, and everyone everyone who contributed to this organization. Our deep-rooted traditional sports should not only be a heritage of the past, but also a guide for our future. Our historical games keep our cultures alive and give the world an important message based on vital principles such as peace, respect, solidarity, and tradition. There can be no room for peace and harmony without unity. I know that the friendship and brotherhood between my homeland, Turkey, and Kazakhstan, and all the members of Organization of Turkic States are deep-rooted bonds nourished by our shared history and values. Additionally, the spirit of solidarity shown by brotherly countries at the World Nomad Games strengthens the bonds of unity that the world needs today more than ever. It is a great honor to see this bond strengthened again here today. As the World Ethnosport Confederation, we are part of the pioneering effort to spread traditional sports worldwide. With 32 members in five continents and 22 countries, these sports do not just represent a competition, they are also symbols of our cultural richness, friendship, and solidarity. We value traditional sports institutionalization and care about unity in ideas and work. Accordingly, the fact that the organization of Turkic states is marching towards the future with strong ties based on shared history and deep-rooted cultures gives everyone hope. Today's organization raises the voice of the Turkic world at the global level and keeps the common values alive. I would like to thank all our member states for their sincere efforts. I also want to emphasize the importance that the President of Turkey, Recep Tayyip Erdogan, attaches to traditional sports on all occasions. He is always supportive on national and international platforms for protecting and handing down traditional sports to future generations. For us, his support is an excellent source of strength. Today, while celebrating the unifying power of sports, we should remember the suffering and human tragedies in different parts of the globe, especially in Gaza. We are supposed to make a joint effort as humanity to end the ongoing brutal crisis as soon as possible and establish peace. We are supposed to demand peace, brotherhood, 
and tranquility for humankind in this organization, where solidarity, compassion, and human values are staged at the highest level. Only respect, peace, and solidarity will keep humanity alive. I firmly believe that this valuable gathering held in Astana with the motto of Ulu Dala Dubiri will breed new friendships, cooperation, and cultural exchanges, not only among people of sports, but also for all countries, especially my homeland, Turkey, and our home country today, Kazakhstan. <laughs> Yeah.